So what he's doing right now is looking for a weak spot. He's walking down an entire fence line trying to find a post that'll budge. Why did we get a smart bull? A smart bull? Well, look at how Insert smart the Titanic music. Of course, I'm going to hum it, being as I don't want to break any copyright laws. Look at this. Folks, when a bull does that right there. Get home. Sookie. Get your tail back home. Go home. Yeah. Tex was here. Folks, I don't know what else to do. Here's the latest of Texas breakouts. Can move. So I don't really know who the aggressor is right here. Care that party, folks. Oh boy, look out! Hookin' Hannah! You got I found Tex. Here's him and Billy. And now the whistle. <laughs> All this for Tex. All this, folks, for a bull named Tex. All right, folks, I know this sounds ridiculous, but this over here, along with what I got built yesterday, all part of my attempt to contain that monster of a bull who we all love so much. You guys gonna let me into work today? <laughs> I got a big project I'm gonna do. And I believe that I'm gonna have an issue with these guys. Cause they're not gonna leave me alone. No, they're not gonna bother me. I know I joked. They're just curious. And they're gonna be into everything. They're gonna be into everything I'm trying to do. This is gonna, you know, you're gonna make this job even more of a challenge than what it already is, baby. I love you and all, don't get me wrong. But you're gonna make my job today very difficult. All right, so I'm gonna put that first hole right here. So this is gonna be our official groundbreaking. <laughs> That's why you cannot let these donkeys just have free roam. That's why you just cannot let these donkeys run around and do what they want to do because they do stuff like this for no reason. Folks, that's why they call them jackasses. That's why you refer to people who are up to no good as a jackass because they just do stuff like this. They're over there messing with something right now. Friends, I'm going to have to turn off this video because you're about to see something that I do not want you to see. I'm going to have to scream at a couple of donkeys because they are messing with everything I'm trying to do. They are biting holes in my concrete bags. They're flipping over nails. Go play! Get away! Sorry y'all had to hear that. No, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it for the baby. The baby's fine. Everything to do with concrete, and I mean everything to do with concrete, is the hardest part of this job. It's just so heavy and bulky. Even mixing this stuff up in these buckets is just a grueling task. And like I said, I mean, in projects like this, you're using my... Oh, you spilt my drink, you dub. Beep, pocket, Hannah. Oh, that was my iced coffee. Hope you enjoyed that. So, uh, what was I saying? No, I mean, in this kind of a project, you're using muscles that you don't use on a regular day basis. So, no matter how much you may exercise or work out or, you know, do the treadmill or whatever you may do, this is the kind of muscle that you just don't use every day. And so, I've worked about... 
uh, I've been out here for two or three hours now and I've done just a small section of the fence and I am exhausted. I'll be calling it a day here. I'm gonna finish this last little piece here to the barn and then I'll be calling it a day and I'll grab the rest of it tomorrow. What can you do, folks? What can you do? Ah, that was my iced coffee. That was my delicious iced coffee. <laughs> I know. No one cares. People are gonna make fun of me. They already do. I know, but <laughs> I just wanted to give a progress update. So it's not snow. I seriously look like trash. Well, baby, you can't expect to be working in the rain. And looking as pretty as you do when we do gift openings. <laughs> Folks, our fence project for Texas coming along. I'm breathing hard. We got a really rainy day here. But uh, I wanted to get this fence done. And if you don't know much about Luster, you should learn that when he gets his mind set on something, <laughs> I'm going to do it. There's a barn rat, Jamie. Well, Can't I'm not it. getting down. Give me that camera. I'm not up here just for fun, folks. There's a barn rat running around. I've never seen a rat here, and I don't want to. And I'm hoping that your dogs right can get out of here. If you're good for anything, dogs, help us. There's a, I'm sitting here moving concrete, and there's a barn rat underneath that concrete bag. And your dogs are good for nothing, Jamie. Look, look at yours. Whoa. Look, Maggie's back here hiding with me. Maggie, help us. Yeah. Yourself. I don't want to video this. I just want to call it a day. All right, yours. Can I One submit my resignation as farm girl at this point? Because this is where I draw the line. He has to know that we're getting closer. And if he's going to run, he might should make his move pretty fast. Or is he, he may be buried alive. Well, that's what I was just thinking. Much longer. <laughs> Did you see the boy rat? Yes. Give me that. Give me the phone. Hey, me. Why did you throw it at me? I did you video the barn rat? Yes. Oh, there it goes. Why did you throw the phone at me? <laughs> Just terrified. Okay. Adventures with barn rats. And you all want to own us. Hey, and everyone wants to run a sanctuary. Folks, uh -uh. and you say you want to run a sanctuary. That was big. That was as big as a cat. This is a monumental occasion. Jamie and I have worked our tails off. And today we're gonna to put that to the test. As this is, you know, this is a had, big test. We've had a heck of a time keeping this bull contained. Go! Let's go! Come on, buddy. Uh-oh. The gang's all coming. The moment of truth. Do I leave the land? Right. Do I go with my daddy? Do I leave my ladies? Food or girls? Uh, uh, food decisions or girls? I'll take food that I'll be right. I'll be right back, girl. Yep. Uh oh. All right, walk. Come on up, babe. I'm gonna close this gate. Come on, Tex. I 
wish I would have dressed up for this. <laughs> I wish I would have dressed up for this. I don't have my hat on or anything. Yeah, well. But what you're seeing here, what you're witnessing is a monument. Boom. Hey, baby, get close to that. Get close. Ready? <laughs> you like the sound of that? Look at here. Five feet tall. Five foot tall. Look at the fences, baby. Walk along the fence line. If he can't, here's our, here's, our, here's our philosophy. Here is our hope. If he can't put his head over it, if he cannot put his head over it, he can't put his head under it, and he's not putting his head through it, I think he'll stay. Cross your fingers, babe. My fingers are crossed. Out, my, they hurt too. They hurt. <laughs> Listen, it's been a long couple of days, folks. That's it's just truth. hard to get this done. Yep. He is not happy. Nope. He's gonna dig a hole right there. Let's go take out some aggression on that barrel. Here we are 24 hours later. Tex and Santana still seem to be uh, content with knowing that this is where they're going to live out their days. <laughs> the fencing project, as difficult as it was, seems to be a success. The blood, sweat, and tears move, baby. We put into this thing, seems to have paid off. Texas Rampage, those days of running rough shot with Billy's girls have come to an end. And at this point, I will have to insert the Titanic music. Of course, I'm going to hum it, being as I don't want to break any copyright laws. Look at this. Folks, when a bull does that right there. Get home. Sucky. Get your tail back home. Oh, my God. Go home. Ooh. I don't know what else to do. Here's the latest of Texas breakouts. It can move. So I don't really know who the aggressor is right here. I think he just took care of that for me, folks. Oh boy, look out! Huckin' Hannah! You got I found Tex. Here's him and Billy. And now the whistle.